Hello, everybody. I knew you'd be back. You just couldn't sleep. It was driving you crazy. You watched my last video. Man, all these brake lines got added and nothing changed. I don't get it. I, you know, this is horrible. I never seen anything like it. Well, I'm going to explain to you now. I'm going to show you uh, something that will make you a god in your own mind, okay? So let's look at the design down. Let's look at the, the surface properties of what I've done here. And I, I gave you a little clue in the last video what to look for. Uh, it just happened to me just a few months ago that, and this was a big learning curve for me. I've been building surfaces for a long time, but I had a coworker that led me down this path that you really need to organize your surface. And this is where you organize it. If you think back to where you created the surface, you might have had a corridor with a surface stuffed in it. You might have had point groups. You might have brake lines. You might have feature lines. I had all those elements. And together, we collaborated and looked at my surface. I had a lot of elements, a lot of things that could go wrong. And the, this list was literally a mile long of brake lines I added as I went for bike paths, parking lots. I had corridors. Uh, super, it got just, I, I, all of this shows you the sequence that I add things. I just added the spillway as the last item. Okay, let's think back to when I created this dam. It's very simple. All I had was the top of the dam, those two lines. I had the off, stepped offset lines, and then I created the daylight lines. So looking back, this is the sequence I had. Let's super organize this now. So you really don't want this all out of sequence. If you look at this, this boundary should be the last thing that you add. Well, it was a while ago until I started doing all these videos with you. So number one is we need to get that boundary added as the last. This is kind of like a draw order or not, a, it's, I guess a draw order of how you, uh, how you would have made the dam from scratch uh, originally. So let's push this boundary to the very bottom. So that would be the very last item that gets built. I just added that spillway. So let's move it up to the other brake lines. Now, I have these three that uh, have these symbols of red be between, they are, items that the, the surface cannot recognize or use anymore because of the draw order. So I am just going to simply remove those. They just mess everything up. So there's the order I put them in. I always put brake lines first, put your contour data. Uh, if you paste a surface in, it would come in here. If you add point groups, uh, it would come in here uh, probably, probably above maybe the, the contour data. You can play with that, but, but break lines first, contours, then organize all of your point data groups, organize your corridors, surfaces, whatever surface you might paste, put them down in here. Make sure there's only one of these minimized flat surfaces. If you build and build and build a surface, you might have two or three of these minimized flat surfaces you only want one and put it in after uh, your uh, other initial things that create those contours. So now let's, I don't know, what have I done? I've rebuilt my surface inside here underneath that definition tag. This is magical, guys. You will, you will look like a true pro here. So let's go ahead and say, okay, rebuild that surface. Look at that. Okay, you're asking me, man, it's still messed up. I've done everything I could do. No, remember back. Civil 3D in all of its glory added those <laughs> added those two points back in. So um, let's go ahead and turn on. I'm just gonna turn the points on this time. I know what's going on. I've seen this before I showed you in the last video. So there they are, there's the culprits. 
I'm just literally going to go in here and I'm going to delete those two points. I'm not going to modify the points. They're creating tin lines in there and stuff I want. What the heck? So I'm going to kill them out of there. And there it is, guys. That is a perfect, spot on, new spillway. Did I do anything? Did I have to sit and calculate out where the intersect of two slopes would be? Did I use the grading command that is so fidgety and, and really touchy? Oh, heck no. It's, it's, life is too short. Make it simple, keep it sweet. Look at that, huh? Huh? <laughs> I'm telling you. Well, anyway, guys, uh, happy catting. Catch you next time.